Hi there viewers, I'm the Extraordinary Tourist and welcome to another of my skate videos. In this video I'm going to be continuing my one trick series where I go through the Braille skateboarding app and try and tick off tricks that I've learnt according to their trick list in which uh, you basically have one trick and then up to four different ways you can do that trick before it's considered that you've completely learned a trick. Uh, last time I was doing frontside 180 ollies and within that I had to do fakie frontside 180 ollies, switch frontside 180 ollies and nollie frontside 180 ollies. Uh, this time we're moving on to backside 180 ollies and that of course means I've also got to do uh, fakey backside 180 ollies which is probably a half cab backside half cab uh, and backside nolly 180 ollie and backside switch 180 ollie I think that's it uh, so the battery on this camera is about to go, so I'm not going to spend mu too much time talking and we'll just get into it. take that one as a land even though I didn't roll all the way backwards because most of the time when I do land these I never roll all the way backwards they always come to a stop but I did the actual 180 ollie part and my feet were on the ground so I'm going to take that as a land for now. Alright so I'm pretty sure the fakie 180 ollie is basically just a half step so going backwards and going that way. So the, the fakie front side 180 ollie that I did last week, I went that way. So, yeah, I'm pretty sure this is just pretty much a half step. But let me know if I'm getting it wrong in the comments below. Front side that way, and the nollie front side has to be going the same way. 
just off the front. So that's my logic. Hopefully it's right. Let me know if it's not. So this has been a bit of a short session today because uh, all the batteries in both my cameras are, I, didn't, I forgot to charge up and I just wanted to get this thing done and I knew there wasn't a high chance of me landing a lot of these the four tricks in this particular um, backside 180 ollie 
uh, because as you saw right at the start, even my backside 180 ollies aren't particularly good. Uh, that's a trick that usually my first and second one of the day are the best ones and then it just deteriorates from there so I think I was pretty lucky to even land what I did today. Um, and the Nolly backside Nolly 180 uh, don't think I got all that close to that one you'd think I'd remember since it was only just a few minutes ago but there you go uh, fakey backside 180 ollie or half cab uh, those things I can almost do with my eyes shut uh, the only thing I'd like to improve on those is perhaps getting them a bit higher off the ground and then as you saw then the switch backside 180 ollie pretty much no chance of landing that I got close with one sort of 90 degree one with both feet on but standing on my tail but that was about the best one of the day so um, and I feel it would be quite a while before I could actually land that one just because of uh, when you do actually landing it land it your stance is like a regular nolly position uh, which on this driveway would sort of stick in my head that I'm going to catch in one of the grooves and kick myself off so can't see myself landing that one anytime soon either but yeah I'm going to leave it at that uh, if you like what you see and this is your first video of mine maybe you'd like to subscribe if you are subscribed hit the bell button so you can be notified of whenever I upload a video I try to upload a video every weekend uh, and if you are new here I make skateboarding and sometimes skateboarding art videos uh, you can buy my artwork on skateboards at my e-tourist website and these skateboarding videos are direct sort of directed to people who are getting back into skateboarding who perhaps were really into skateboarding earlier in life but for whatever reasons uh, dropped out or are starting skateboarding late. I myself am just turned 50 this year and I'm sort of trying to relearn a lot of the stuff that I learnt back in the 90s, early 90s when I was hardcore into skating and while I never stopped skating I sort of only used the skateboard for getting around on up until about 2017 where I sort of from then on have been trying to get back into it that's it i'm gonna leave it there till the next video i'll see you later bye for now